Are you done? Hey yo what is happening guys this is Eli Nietzsche coming at you with another video so today we are going to be talking about Final Fantasy 7 Remake Part 2 so Final Fantasy 7 Remake Part 2 uh, is actually in full development which is a great thing we also got some stuff about uh, Madden M and my boy Roche or Roche hey, however you want to pronounce it so without further ado let's just uh, dive straight into it as you can see right here, Nova Crystallis Final Fantasy VII Remakes Part 2 is in full development. Final Fantasy VII Remakes second installment has entered full development according to staff interviews published by Famitsu this week. The magazine spoke with several key members of the development team including director Tetsuya Nomura. Here's what he had to say when asked about the release of the upcoming for the next entry of the project. We know that everyone wants the next installment quickly. We would like to also deliver it as soon as possible since we were able to uh, seal the line of quality for the first installment. We hope to make the next installment even better in quality then uh, that can make a for an even better experience. We would like to get it out as soon as possible so please wait for it. I think we can clearly convey the direction we officially uh, when officially announced the next installment so they basically said uh, they will they know when they're gonna announce it uh, at least a teaser for it so hopefully soon uh, since it's in full development so that's that's pretty good producer no Yoshinori Kitase notes the new story of Final Fantasy 7 has only just begun so yeah it just begun so we're gonna be playing until part 75 that's great uh, other bits found within the 15 uh, page spread uh, no note that minor spoilers the new character for Roche was um, meant to appear some parts of chapter 14 to do battle according to co-director Toyama uh, the character has a high chance of reappearing in the next installment that's really good I honestly feel Roche could be that one character that changes everything uh, then they said additionally uh, parts like Madden M's massage scene uh, weren't allowed to go any further in according to the age keeping rating and Avalanche's hideout wasn't added to show that Cloud didn't have a close relationship to them yet. That's a very great uh, way to actually hide the hideout uh, from Cloud. That's why he never actually go in like in the original he went in the hideout. Uh, so yeah it's very interesting that they chose this way. The Madam M stuff I can I can see why because of age rating and all of that but I am excited that Roche is definitely going to be within the next well most likely will be in the next installment I'll say 99% sure he would be in the next installment and also I would also like to say that the second part is in full development that's pretty good that's uh, I'm really happy that uh, Square Enix is in full development for Final Fantasy 7 Remake Part 2 uh, Tetsuya Nomura is a part of it so that means uh, but Besides Melody of Memory and other stuff like that, uh, it's going to be interesting to see how Tetsuya Nomura will enhance the Kingdom Hearts lore while still working on Final Fantasy VII Remake. Uh, anyway guys, that is it for this video. Please leave a like, help me a lot, comment down in the comment section down below what you guys think. Share with friends, because sharing is caring, and most importantly, subscribe to become a fellow Lightning Bolt. Anyway guys, uh, that is it for this video, and as always, this is Lightning H8, uh, blaze out.